Did you see it? Did you see that? I'm gonna show it to you in just a second. What is it? Is it a footprint really in stone? I mean, there are footprints in stone all over the world, humans and dinosaurs and other types of animals, but in a stone this old? Or is stone really as old as the scientists are telling us? I'm gonna show you what looks like a human footprint, size 12, triple E, right beside me, right below me. The stone in question is about five to six inches thick. It's 42 inches in length and about 19 inches wide. Do you see anything unusual? Well, look at this first off. Is this a little baby foot in stone? Look at it closely. I don't know, it looks like it could be small, but it just resembles it. All right, so you can see that it's been eroded away here and there. No, that's not it. Oh, there it is. That's the big toe. I'm gonna go in real close to show you the big toe. The rest of the foot right here, the heel right here. Is it? Here's what we did. We filled it with latex and then we made an impression of it to see what it would be. Look, at what, what this is what we found. Some people swear after seeing this, including my wife, it is a footprint. See the big toe right there? The heel? What do you think? This is obviously an older stone, according to evolution, geology, shouldn't be there. Stone was donated to the museum. It was found in Cranks Creek in Harlan County, Kentucky. Up. So if it is a footprint, what's the problem? Here's the problem. If this is 200 million years old, then there shouldn't be a human footprint there. If stone isn't 200 million years old, and just say this was formed relatively recently, like in a worldwide flood of Noah, then this could be a human footprint. But see, that's the problem. Scientists are bent that this is old and it cannot have anything like this in there so that immediately eliminates the possibility. But if that is a human footprint, then this is not that old because obviously humans did not live 200 million years ago. Do you see? This is not the first time artifacts like this have been found that call into question geologists dating of the earth. Keep an open mind on this. They may be wrong and if they are wrong, as I suspect, then the sedimentary rock and the fossils that we find are mere thousands of years ago, not millions of years ago. Thanks for watching. For those of you that like this kind of content, you know what to do. I'll see you in the next video.